Then, it's finally over. For you, what of yes. What the and God I sent to assist you? Really? Do we really have to talk about them? They were slain by the Morag Tong. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. All right, Zelzaz, Atar and Zavok have taken a boat back to Skyrim. If you find the time, couldn't hurt to pay your respects at the temple. Thank you for annoying me while I'm talking. Anyhow, they're back in Skyrim. This is going to be your operation since you feel so strongly about helping these people. I'll follow your lead. All right, let's go. We are to go inside the Ancestral Tomb. They want to give tomb. the Talmithrin a wide berth. I don't like the looks of that place one bit. Who is this no nosy god that keeps interrupting us? Come on, let's go. I'm not sure what we are to discover here. There is a limit to how much hist sap one should have at once. There is such a thing as sap poisoning. Some oh, symptoms of include course. gold tongue. Where gold sap has tongue. Their mouths golden in hue. Others have had their scales turn into bark. It's not a pretty sight. I'm sure it isn't. What's this? A moth biosphere. Hmm. All right, the ancestral tomb requires a key. I think we've waited. Are we supposed to be hiding? Come this way. Look, there's someone. Someone's in here. Let's go see who it is. Oh, this is this is exciting. I can't make out who it is from the back. All right, let's go. I think I think her name is Tillisu. Did we meet her earlier? Come back this way. You know, don't worry, my magics is canceling out the sound of my voice so that she can't hear me talking. Did she leave? No, she's still here. Right, come on, let's go quickly.
All right, we are supposed to go and see Adril. What are you doing that for? You lost. They serve the best Su Jam I've ever tasted over for wretched Natch. Worth Martin every call. Counselor? I'm hearing that the Council will be staying in Blacklight permanently. Well, of course. Now that they're under House Rederan's protection, why would they want to go back to Mournhold? My thoughts exactly, my friend. Mm. Excuse me. I hope Geld has proved useful. Have you made any progress? Yes, I suspect that Tillisu Severin is the culprit. Tillisu. Of course, Cindy. Are you sure? What troubles you? I saw her in the Ulan tomb. So Geldus's plan worked, eh? Every time we tried it, no one would ever show up. If Tillisu's involved in any sort of plot to harm Councillor Morvey, I'm going to need hard evidence I fear to prove we'll be feasting on Ashians a bit more often. Well, year. why don't you go and search their house? I'm not kicking down anyone's door until I have solid evidence in hand. If you're wrong about Telesu, things would quickly go downhill around here, and the real culprits might slip away. I can't afford for that to happen. And what if they try to stop me? If you have evidence and it places your life in peril, I would expect you to do whatever you must to keep yourself alive. Here, this key should open the front door of the manor in case they've locked it. Good luck. Ooh. <laughs> Very well. But can you tell me more about the Severin family? Tell us who is wife to the family patriarch, Vendel. They have a single child, a daughter named Miriam. They arrived here ten years ago and have been nothing but a benefit to Raven Rock ever since. A benefit? How? They're quite wealthy and they've been quite generous by sharing their fortune with the community. They've contributed coin, food, supplies, even helped repair a few of the buildings in town with their own hands. Well... I suppose I should be impressed. So there's nothing unusual about them at all. People have mentioned it's a bit odd about how close in age Mary appears yeah, to be to her father, but that's hardly a of cause course, for alarm. What troubles? Just make sure you find solid evidence. Stores, if I accuse them without it, so I'll be the laughing journey. stock of the colony. <laughs> <laughs> well, we to can't have that, that can we? So how are things now that the mines are so open again? You might think it's all perfume and roses we'll now that the mines are open. A bit more often. All I see is a new security problem on our hands. You would. Making sure those shipments of ebony make it safely from the mine to the shipping docks is my new order of the day. And with Solstheim crawling with reavers and Azora knows what else, I can't risk any attacks on Ravenrock. All right then. I'd like to know why the Ulans have a tomb in Raven Rock. Villa Ulan wasn't the first Ulan to live in Raven Rock. His father, Valen Ulan, was one of the first Dunmer to settle here. Unlike his son, Villa, Valen was a good man. He contributed to the community and was quite respected. When Valen died, his family provided the funds to construct the tomb. But you told me that House Lalu was disliked. The Ulan family being a part of House Lalu didn't matter. It's Dunmer's tradition for the ashes of the deceased to be placed in an ancestral tomb. Valen Ulan and his son's remains were both laid to rest there because that's what he'd requested. That'll be all. Be careful. If the Severans have betrayed us, then they'll be well armed. <laughs> back from the I hope that they are. <laughs> For their sake. All right, so where are these people? The Severn Manor is this, this way. This may be the frontier, but we've still got rules. Break them and you'll wind up in the prisons. 
I don't know what you're playing at, Glover, but something about you just doesn't add up. Understandable, considering the differences between us. I suspect we've already spooked the Severance by that. poaching Tillisio in the tomb. I have a knack smelling trouble. If they are guilty and you find us in their home, they will put up a I fight. I promise you, I have nothing but... Well, it sounds like you're ready for it. I don't know about you, Ooh, but I'm itching for a fight. Ooh, ha ha ha! Right, so can we do this stealthily? I wonder why this book is so important for her. To have Stop hiding, coward! I I'll make it quick. What was that? This how we're doing this? Ow! Oh, how slowly! Have it's Seriously, shouldn't you be hiding in the shadows, coward? It's not my time. Well, so much for stealth. <laughs> oh, it's Tillisu, dead. It's a shame. Necklace of Heraldry. Take 8% less attack damage. While blocking, I'll take that. Ring of Minor Lockpicking. I'll take that too. I don't know these enchantments. That's amazing. Let's take the Severin key. And how about Miri? Where's the safe key? I'll take that too. Well. I suppose we'll just leave the corpses here for now. Come on. I thought about turning them to ash, but they really don't have any powers that would benefit me at all. I suppose we're looking for a safe somewhere. moment there I thought that was a person <laughs> quite the bedroom display cases mannequins weapon racks oh what's this over here Try this key and see what we find. An ancient letter. The conditions here in Vardenfeld are worsening by the moment. Red Mountain spews a nearly non-stop gout of ash and flame, and I fear that I cannot remain much longer. I've done what I could to preserve a few relics from the museum, but I have one very vital artifact that I am entrusting to you, dear Vindil. It is a relic that the great saint once held as a prize, and one that both saved and doomed Morrowind in the end. The Dwemer, Wraith God of Kagranak, I entrust to you. Keep it safe, and once the house Halalu is once again in power, you can display it proudly. It is a relic of our legacy, dear friend. Guard it well and ensure that it is well hidden in Skyrim. Can I take that? Yes, I'll take these Vala stones. 
septums, and the Ulan matter. Dear Councillor Salden, in a matter of days, I believe, we'll be ready. Our forces hidden within Ashfall Citadel, Ashfalo Citadel, have been training night and day, ready to strike when we give the signal. With Captain Veloth, Veloth distracted by the Ashborn attacks, the timing seems perfect. I've waited nearly a decade to exact my revenge upon Luril Morvane for the death of my ancestor, and I long for the moment my blade will be drawn across his throat. The next letter you receive from me will include his head in a sack. <laughs> Display it proudly in the halls of House Lalu, brother, Vindil Ulin. <laughs> you know, you have to marvel at the, the intrigue here on this island. All right. I think... House Lalu cretins. Bastards shouldn't have just lost their great house privileges. They should have forcefully disbanded and rooted out. This is Nova yet. We must return to Adril. All right. Isn't your... So, uh... I mean, caught up in this. I don't know why. I mean, you're not even a... A dark elf. But I suppose the Telvani connection that you have is reason enough. Alright, this is this is good. So there is something afoot here. Alright. We'll just leave the bodies. It's quiet, for the moment. Something troubling you? I'd think you'd welcome a little peace and quiet. Apologies, Adril. In my experience, it's usually the quietest before the storm. Oh, you're being pessimistic. Did you find any evidence at Severin Manor yet? Ooh. <laughs> oh, don't walk away. And don't mind my cackling. I just get so uh tickled by the mechanizations of mortals <laughs> so i found evidence proving Excuse the severin's guilt do you have any plans then we finally have them we feel all that remains now is bad. chasing them down and if bringing them to justice my disposal, build your wall i don't them. think they'll give up willingly Go. I know you're doing everything. I'm you going can. to send two of the best Reverend Guard we I'll have, sure we have to take them down. Over there. Only two. I'll you to you. assist them any way you can. All right then. Well, haven't I done enough? If even one of these House Lalu Switz escapes, they won't just be after Councillor Morvane. You've proven devastating to their plans, and they'd stop at nothing to hunt you down. Well, welcome to try. It's time to take the fight to them and finish this. All right, then. Since I have no choice and the way Zelzaz is looking at me, I'll head there immediately. See that you do. We can't afford to let these traitors slip away. All right. Wherever it is we're heading. The Redoran God. How far is this, anyway? <laughs> Lurker ambush. All right, I suppose we can um, fast travel then. And here we are, since there are no carriages or anything. I. Oh, I hope this is all right. What? Oh, those things again. All right. 
No, I've forgotten what a lot of these powers are. These what spells. Was that? It's those things I again. Heard you coming. <gasps> Distortion flux. Huh. Doesn't seem to be doing much. Snow or you. All right, I think I need. Do I have. No, I don't have a common lightning spell. I've had worse. Mm. Of course, that's the best way. How are you doing down here? Oh, you've dispatched them. Ooh, ooh, ah, ha, 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 excellent. Oh, look, there's more. Come on. Oh, no, they're gone. No, oh, there, there's something up here. Come on. Hold on. Something's up. Oh, yes. I have a try attack for all of you. <laughs> oh, look at this, an ash hopper. Oh, and a bear. Ooh, this try attack does leave something to be desired. But if you creatures think that you're going to harm me, you're sadly mistaken. <laughs> All right, Zelzaz, here I come. Oh, you dodged my attack. There we are. Finished. All right, that was thrilling. <laughs> Come on, let's go. What was that? Oh. It's down this way, near the stairs. And blood. And the Redoran God, one of them is dead already. <laughs> what? The other one dead. See, I said when he said two, I, you know, he should have dispatched a platoon. <laughs> Wait, Zelzaz, you went ahead without me. Death is what you seek. You'll get your wish. And so the world was made a better place. You are really outdoing yourself. Use Morag Tong armor. This looks like something similar to what Zelzaz is wearing. What? Wait, there's no armor. Why do these things say light armor so and the there's no armor? the cowards have aligned themselves with the Morag Tong. Good. All right, let's we'll go. Make this victory all the sweeter when I avenge Master Sewell. Ah, so is this why you're so interested? Master Sewell. Alright, I think we should go in and see what's happening here. And... I don't know what powers I want to use. It's really sort of too bad when you have too many. <laughs> oh, boy. Hmm. All right, let's see what, what we can do.
Well, there's certainly a lot of death here. What was that? What was... Wait. That wasn't you, Zelzaz. That was another voice. But where is Zelzaz? Oh, there you are. Someone's here. Oh, here he is. I knew it. For House Talvani. No, For he's Master a... Soul. He's under my control. <laughs> I've picked up a thing or two from Mirak. Need something. Come on, follow me. <laughs> the sad part will be when the spell wears off. <laughs> Let's go. Every time I revisit Thorn, it's different. The rivers and bodies of water. Oh, oh, what? Get him! Take this. Yeah. Bastard. Hmm. Uh, All right. I had words. Your death will bring you to There we are. My blade still thirsts for at more. Least, at least someone who is vulnerable to shock. <laughs> You know, it's really one of my favorite attacks. It's it's a shame that I can't use it that often here in this realm. All right, check the quarters for anything that you might want. Do you need uh Well, I guess there's no sense in trying to get armor and temper it since there's no armor on the armor. If that makes any sense at all. <laughs> all right. Take these gems. Let's see. Oh, here's a common soul gem. Let me. I think I have something that I can You're going learn. To do that right oh, several somethings. Right now. Yes, I am going to do this right now, and you will wait and be patient. So, an, a honed lunar steel battle axe. Yes, I'll learn that. An iron mace of dawn scorches the undead for 16 points. Or damage, whatever. A necklace of heraldry. Take 8% less attack damage while blocking. And a ring of minor lock picking. I'm surprised that I haven't discovered that sooner. And a ring of wealth, five gold per hour. There we are. That should lighten my load slightly. <laughs> All right, what else do we have here? Nothing. What is this? This amulet of Mafala. <laughs> okay, with no enchantment. All right. Scourge of the Grey Quarter. I keep forgetting to read these books. All right, let's... I think this is the chain that we need. All right, we'll try these two spells together. seem to carry anything valuable 
Who's that? Armorless armored Morag Tong outfit. Oh, what did I open? It's a bunch of traps here. Alright, let's see what this did. Oh, and here's another one. There we are. And there are more. Let's see what we've got in here first. Watch these pressure plates. How did I know? All right, I'm having trouble. Oh, look, there's another one. Ah. The general philosophy of House Redoran seems to be that suffering builds character. I'm just not sure they know when to stop suffering. They probably don't. Is someone there? All right, here they come. Over what here. was that? Held <laughs> <laughs> by your own trap. I hear something. Now you have to do better. Much better than that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now you're triggering the trap yourself. All right, who is this back here? Something's wrong here. You, my friend, are finished. <laughs> Oh, I haven't had this much fun in a long time. <laughs> Excellent. Remind me, what were we the here to do? The has been rooted out of Raven Rock, and my blade has tasted Morak Tong blood. I apologize for my outbursts. I... Let us return to Adro. You'll be all right, Zelzaz. You've done good work here today. Let's see what's in this chest. You know, you would think it would be something amazing. <laughs> For the trouble that we've been through. All right, well. That's done. A little bit disappointing. I'd hope they'd put up more of a fight. Still trying to learn all these different spells and power at my command, but still, they got what they deserved. <laughs> Vindal Severin. So, heavy armor is 20% more effective. One-handed, 30% more damage. Look at this. This is heavy armor, and there's no armor on it. Someone help me understand this. Ring of the Forge grants an enchanted weapon at random intervals. Oh, well, maybe I can learn that. Okay. Thank you, Vindal. Watch the plates, watch the plates. I don't want my armor scratched. <laughs> let's go, let's go and talk to Adril. Did we lock ourselves in here? Well, not anymore.
And I thought, weren't the, the Morag Tong supposed to be formidable? Well, I suppose they were to the, the poor veteran gods outside, but I, I'm still rather disappointed. <laughs> I don't understand why Nords distrust magic. Magic oh, wait. is an incredible tool. My wait, something's here. Fall upon my blade, Morag Oh, just die. <laughs> All right. I still don't really understand what this spell is doing for me. But it seems to partially immobilize them so that I can blast them. All right, well, maybe we'll be lucky and there'll be more and more ragtong outside. Hmm, no such luck. All right, then, I suppose we should head back to Raven Rock and talk to Adril. Oh, is this Adril out for an evening stroll? <laughs> What happened? Were you able to track down Vendel? Out with it! He's no longer a threat. Then, it's finally over. For you, What of yes. the Redoran Guard I sent to assist you? Really? Do we really have to talk about them? They were slain by the Morag Tong. Damn it. I was hoping to protect our people by sending them, not end up with casualties. To think that Vendel would stoop so low as to hire those fetchers. I'm glad you killed him. Well, I did what had to be done. <laughs> wonderful. Simply wonderful. Counselor Morvane will be quite pleased when he hears about this. I'm sure he will. <laughs> All right then, so, I suppose we'll go talk to him now, and get our reward. You still, keep your head up, you did a good job, Zelzaz, come on. I have a complicated relationship with the East Empire Company. Some of them have been quite honest and a pleasure to deal with. Others have been complete scoundrels. They're a good source for foreign goods in Morrowind, though, I must say. Hmm. I believe Councillor Morbain wants to speak to you. Oh, really? He wants to have an audience with me. <laughs> oh, I just can't get over how tickled I am at all this. Come on. Thank you for putting us on this path, Zelzaz. This has been most the entertaining. Over the iron oh, will you be quiet? Silence! I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, Fred? So what you've done for me, for all of Raven Rock, goes far beyond what I would have expected from a traveler to our town. I'm sure it does. For this, you have my deepest gratitude. Of course I do. Thank you. It's the least you could say. Now, I'm certain Adriel was prepared to reward you appropriately for everything you've done. Was he? He didn't say However, anything about that. Since a bit of coin hardly seems like enough. It isn't. I've decided to provide something more substantial. Oh, really? Since the Severin family, or whoever they were, turned out to be criminals, their property is now forfeit. As counselor, I hereby award you Severin Manor and everything contained within. You've earned your citizenship here, and I hope you'll consider staying with us as a member of our community. Hmm. Well, that's quite kind. <laughs> what do you think of that, Zelzaz? We're citizens now. 